Hello and welcome everybody, I'm Papa Varian and we are returning Crusader Kings 2 with Khalif Suleiman. And I gotta ask you, have you ever thought to yourself, what if we rebelled against the most powerful ruler in the world? And yes, uh, you know, too bad for you Aztecs, but you are not the most powerful ones, it is clearly me. Have you ever thought, you know, might as well rebel against him, he's only 14, right? It is time to beat up all those that believe that they can beat us. Because this will never happen, look. <laughs> Even we imprisoned this most powerful king in the entire realm and still everyone else was like, yeah, we can surely beat him. No, 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 you can't do squad, buddy. So what we're going to do in this episode is we're going to beat them up and we're gonna, then we're going to move on. We're going to do whatever is necessary to make things happen. I'm actually going to hire what, the Arab, sure, the Arab company. Sounds fine to me. Uh, everyone else, yep, that is good. All of this is also good. We are going to win this war and I think with a... Quite the, the lead here. And once we've won it, I will finally, I'm absolutely certain, in this life, get the hunting achievement. By God, give me the hunting achievement. Chola approves of my patient diligence, but thinks I should be even more focused on the results of my efforts. Hell yeah, please. Let's go, this child. Oh, I regret nothing. You know what, Hussein? You were worth something. You were worth giving birth to this kid. That actually is incredibly helpful. Uh, when will you arrive the 19th? I'm gonna be there earlier. Nope, I won't. I will be there on the 19th. I think they're gonna get away here just in time, right? Yeah, they did. Of course they did. Right, with that being said, why don't you just head in over here? Hmm. It's quite a few, fee uh, few people down here. Just, you know, I, I guess start sieging over there? I don't actually know. Difficult to tell. What to do with these people. There's so many people, by God. I didn't catch anyone, he is sad. Alright, uh, let's take them all out. I am incredibly amazed by the fact that they actually dared rebel, but you know, I'm gonna teach them a lesson here. A lesson of don't rebel, because if you do, that will be quite nasty for you. Oh, definitely, by the way, do not go there. You're lucky enough that you can actually beat them up. Where are they going? Hmm. Oh, you know what I did not see? Oh. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Bring them all down here, please. Yes, thank you. We're gonna go up there and defeat them in just a second. But there is no hurry. Or, well, at least we, we don't have to hurry because we're in a pretty good situation. You know, they're gonna go here for the mountains. We're gonna be fine. Ah, uh, yeah. No, we're definitely perfectly fine. I think we might even hire another mercenary band. Look at this. This is, this is great. They're gonna, they're gonna lose this, no doubt about it. You know, I was a bit concerned by the fact that our armies are so split up, but honestly, it's a bit of a benefit here, now that I think about it. And I think we can defeat you. It's mountains and everything, but I think we'll be fine. With over 10,000 troops, almost double the size of these people. Why don't you get the best commanders that we have? Then uh, go in there. Go in a good time. Easy. That's just how the cookie crumbles. What are you, you know? They will never learn it. The AI never understands that they will not win any of these revolts. They always go for it. Every single time they're like, yeah, this time around we will surely beat them. Have you seen the revolt get beaten back in like the last two years? Let's do it again, guys. Every time. When you're going to Asab, you are a fool, my friend. Yep. That was not very smart of you. Not very smart of all, uh, at all. They split up here, which was definitely their demise. I mean, what can I say? Oh, I'm gonna let... Ooh, you're all descending on this hand. You are actually going to keep walking. They're not afraid of me. I hate to see it. So what we are going to do here is... Uh, I would like to rally all my boats over here. Then we're gonna see how many we have. I would like to transport the 12k down here so that we can go on and beat up the main army. The main stacks here. Are we already at 33%? Absolutely beautiful, seriously. Who are you? Hell yeah, burn him. Get him out of here. Think I have patience with these people? Are you crazy? You know who I am. Hmm, all of these can go, actually. You should not go. Could spawn in down here, thank you. Wonderful. How quickly will this go? Very quickly, actually. I'm, I'm gonna let that happen. It's fine. Are they going to fight me? Is my main question here. I don't think they are. 
I'm not too concerned. Yeah, they're good. What a, you know, sometimes these rebellions happen. I, in the last episode, I really just wanted a comfortable become 16 kind of ending, right? They just really had to go, no, 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 no. Let me just become a member in your prison, yeah? And uh, that they will be. By the way, you can also become a member of the channel if you just uh, click on the join button. Bottom right. Bottom right, guys. Doesn't really work if there's no Twitch Prime, I guess, but that's fine. Let's just get them out of here as soon as possible, as quickly as possible, I should say. So that we can then carry on and, uh, you know, focus on the more important parts of this playthrough. Which, to me, kind of, uh, come down to conquering this stuff. Oh, they have a Celtic Revolt and conquering Anatolia. I definitely want to take Anatolia and we do have a free Jihad right here. I think we're gonna just declare Jihad immediately. Once we grow up to be 16 and once this war is over, I think that is the right move to make. Why are you all... Now there you go. There we go. Alright, we made it. Eh, let's just move in over here. Time to show him a good time. Think of assassins, he's coming for what title? Baylor? Seriously? Wait a minute, no, that's not my title. What? Wait, oh, I guess he doesn't have a claim, but he just hates me. Well, I mean, whatever you say, buddy. Come fight me. Try it. See how well it goes. Um, in that case, I'm gonna... And there you go. Oh, look at that. A brilliant strategist. Oh, this is a good character. Khalif Suleiman, you are a good character. Absolutely excellent. Do you have a genius? Do have a genius? Ooh, we have a 19-year-old. That is even better because that means I can immediately marry her. Now, we're gonna go hunting, as we always do. We're gonna groom an heir. Absolutely. Now we're all gonna head in up here. How are you doing the 19th and the 19th? We actually arrive on the 7th. Oh, that's absolutely perfect. Wonderful. Thank you. We just got married. We love to see it. We have a strong woman. Actually. They're all Sunni, not you. We did marry a Sunni, just for the record. I'm fully aware, but, you know. Now, I'm not gonna lead armies personally just yet, because I do want some of these events for hunting. Um, can't go on the Hajj because we are in a war. Let's just destroy him. And then we're gonna go to Mecca and then we're gonna go to Anatolia. I think that is the perfect combination here. You, my friend, are getting dunked on. Look at this. This is the dunk. At a festive outing in the wild, I find a message left uh, amongst wildflowers addressed to my courtier Sophia. The would-be lover, Emir Idris, is waiting for her by the stream near the camp. I swear to God, and I'm not even kidding you, I swear to God that we're looking at a situation where everyone in Accord has an affair. Every single time that- oh, he's not even in Accord. Wait, I mean, he's not even a direct vassal, I should say. Who the hell is Safia? I don't know her. My sister. Nope. I have no idea. Hello, mother. We married you off again, it appears. That's okay. No, this is- I swear to god, we gotta just keep getting these events. There have been so many events of us seeing a would-be lover doing his thing. It's insane. Now, let's finish this. And then never look back. We're gonna add, uh, you know, a few good... Uh, <laughs> new sites to our embalmed uh, situation there. You know what? Let's become rivals with them. Hell yeah! Let's have a storyline where we're both ambitious and rivals. I mean, I'm not ambitious, I suppose, but I don't like him. Alright, this war's over. You know what is also over? Your lives. Embalm prisoner. Embalm prisoner. Listen, even if it gives me tyrant, I don't think it does, but it doesn't matter. All of you are, go are going on the banquet. Every single king. We got him, guys. Ladies and gentlemen, we got an intimidated court. Let me just take a look here. How do you feel about me? See, this is what I'm talking about. There's no tyrant modifier for this. Absolutely beautiful. We are the lords of these very strange lands where we just keep embalming people. Well, with that being said, why don't we launch a jihad, huh? How many orthodox are there? Not that many. I mean, I think they might be able to resist us. But we're definitely going to go for a jihad for Anatolia, yeah. No, I, I have no doubt that we should go for that. What are we doing in terms of... Where is my retinue? Is it down here? Oh yeah, my retinue and the... 
I'm gonna take you. Are you mad at me, by the way? I did kill a close, yeah, murder close kin, but that's only a minus. It's a minus 30 modifier for, mer for making his close kin a literal permanent acid. Why can't I raise my fleets? Oh, there you go. Now I can. You're gonna go down here, you're gonna transport us up, and then we're gonna declare the jihad with our troops practically already up there. We're pretty bad, you know that? You wanna marry her? No? Oh, yeah, no, that is a different lady. That's fine. Why don't you marry the Sultan of Iraq? Now that everyone else has gone after they have resisted, uh, after we taught them a lesson, let's make it clear that this shall never be repeated by anyone. Beautiful. Yeah, we're gonna declare the jihad in a second here. Yeah, I'll make it diligent. I became patient instead. Look, I'm willing to make everyone a good person. But nothing against that. And here's the amazing thing, by the way. I destroy these 155 and all of a sudden they're over here. How do they do it? Nobody knows. And I don't think anybody, anybody needs to know, you know? That's just uh, as simple as it is. Now, that being said, the jihad is coming. Ooh, look at this, we're still making this in a chunk of money. If I'm not wrong, yes, yeah, Cyprus is part of Anatolia. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna land in Cyprus, actually. You're already at war with some people, that's fine. Jihad for Anatolia, my friend. Will be done. The great Shia Caliph Suleiman has decided to call a jihad against the Kafirs in the Kingdom of Anatolia. He urges all righteous Shia Muslims to take up arms against the depraved Vasileos Evangelos of the Byzantine Empire for the glory of Islam. Allah is merciful. Indeed he is. Uh, everybody meet up over there please. We're gonna take the armies. We're gonna take the Holy Order. Hell yeah. And I think we might even take some more mercenaries. I just really need to dunk on him. And you know what? Now that I talk of Duncan. No, I'm gonna just let them walk. Who cares? Walking is fine. Don't sweat it. Look at that. Um, make me a mujahideen, a uh, mujahid, please. We done it. We have done it. Mashallah. Mashallah. There you go. Personal combat skill plus ten. It is insanely good. Time to dunk on him, boys. Time to dunk on every single one of these fools. Not many people joining though, I guess because they're all our vassals, you know, it does make a lot of sense. But Anatolia will fall! <sighs> and if I then get rid of a... Uh, excuse me game? If I then get rid of this stuff, if I can hold this, we will have wonderful borders. Almost being, you know, the Ottomans. Beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. When you get on the boats. Could you serve some titles? I don't really care about any duchy titles though. Sure. Do I need to worry about anything else? The adventure thread is not really an adventure thread. Uh, what about some science? I want to put in some stuff in cavalry here. The camel cavalry is just, you know, you gotta go with it. I mean... Yeah, sure. Let's make our retinue even stronger. Get on the boats. Just gonna siege down Cyprus. And then we're gonna move on to the mainland. Younger Shavna loves uh, loves doing things her own way and often takes it personally and gets angry when others offer opinions. I should help guide her in the right direction. Absolutely. Did become diligent. That's excellent. Very, very nice. Get on the boats. Keep sieging, boys. Keep sieging. We are the only... I mean, we are the only participants, so I will definitely get the title here. At some point, when I was the Bali Caliph in a different playthrough, at some point, for some reason, whenever I declared a jihad and I won it, the person that got it was an Ibadi Burn... Ne, no, Ibadi Burtpa. Is that the culture? I think, right? The Tibetan culture? Burtpa? Yeah. An Ibadi Burtpa uh, person would get the kingdom. I do not understand why, but it definitely threw me off at the time. And who are you? You just... I don't think you're directly involved in this one. You just... Yeah. No. Not directly involved. That's fine. Um, I think I'm gonna put you on the boats. Known for his expansionist policy has died, that's fine. Don't sweat it. Put you on the boats and we're already gonna go over here. Very nice. We're losing some money, but we'll be fine. In the midterm here. Thing is, we will definitely win this jihad. Once they stop sieging, I'm gonna put them in the mainland as well. Man, this is just, it's too fluid, you know that? <laughs> it's too easy to go and completely destroy them. Uh, we should definitely declare war for Syria, I suppose. Hmm. Hmm. Our borders won't look good for quite some time, I'm afraid. 
Afika worries that the people of my realm lack just judgment. And also, by the way, I do no longer want to command my troops. But he's a warrior, Afika. Right. You are Sunni. Sure, whatever, bro. You do you. You may. Put him on the boats and... And you put him over here. Absolutely ridiculous just how many people we got. Ready to serve and ready to destroy. I'm gonna actually just send you up there, you know? Fine. Get on the boats. I think I may have lost some people there, but that's okay. I'll take the attrition. Whatever. Look at this. Perf- Oh, okay. Perfect boat economy. I was about to say, but I noticed nothing about this is perfect. But we will definitely crush them right here. I might even assault this. Is this level 6? It is. Of course it is. What else could it be? Ah, we lost more people there. I couldn't stop, you know, stop it from happening. Hmm, what is happening here? Gains the, uh, the trade's dressed. That sounds about right for somebody as busy as we are. Hmm. They're leaving. Interesting. I'm gonna just put you over here. Let's just keep sieging. All of these are quite powerful, and I think we could unite our troops in time if they were to attack us. What a dumb attack is this? They're going... They could... They could have gone for 3.5 here and probably done a good amount of damage before my other troops arrive. But with this, I mean, this is just ridiculous. They're gonna die. They're all gonna die. Good god. Good riddance, I guess, if, you know, that is what the worth of their troops is to them, then so be it. And they go. And they didn't even have commanders. I mean, come on, what is this? Yeah, yeah. Ibn Hussein, my brother. Welcome. You know what? I think I'm gonna give my brother... Oh, he's gonna murder me, isn't he? But I would love to give my brother Anatolia. I really would. I, I think it's a grand idea. <laughs> I think that could be fun. Absolutely. Oh, this was closer than I uh, would have hoped for, but there you go. Elisarius. Now, that's a good name. That is a good name. Miletios and uh, look at them. So many people now in our prison. Unlucky, my dude. Oh, this is fine, yeah. Here we go. Ninety-three percent. It is almost over. Look at this. We rule supreme over Anatolia. Hell yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. Now, see, I, I don't have a good relationship with my brother, and I'm intelligent, but I do want him to be in a situation where he doesn't plot against me, so do that, I do think I will grant him the new kingdom. I will make you happy, brother. We don't like each other, but it is custom, isn't it? Go, sure. Ankara. I already hold the kingdom title. I assume I don't. Kingdom of Anatolia. Beautiful. May you rule over it, my... Dear brother, when are the when is this gonna disappear? Eleven seventy nine. We have ten years, and then he's gonna start hating us. Oh God, why? All right, let's get rid of all of you. I think we're gonna instantly go, instantly go against the Seljuks here. Yeah? I would like to invade. Yeah, we still would not have a land connection. That is so ridiculous. We need three wars to get a land connection. We need Armenia. We need Al Jazeera and we need Syria. Come on now. I think we're gonna go with Armenia in the hope that the rest might split up because it will be uh, not connected. Let's go for Armenia here, I think, yeah. Let's do it. Again, everybody over there, thank you very much. And let's uh, go sieging. Let's have some fun. I gotta tell you, this has been a very busy playthrough when it comes to just going ahead and destroying our enemies, but I am enjoying it because we are empire building on an entirely new scale. Invasions, uh, land grabs, you know, we can do some great conquests as well in the future against the Mignesid Empire, and they have been weakened quite so considerably. I mean, they are no longer, uh, you know, Nahua or Aztec. Quite interesting. Ah, oh, straighten up, buddy. Thank you. I appreciate that quite a bit. 
Okay, we'll hand all of this stuff out, I think. My half-brother, Sultan Yahya of Anatolia, understands that he is living a life of haram and has ensured me that he is committed to changing his ways. Thank you. I imagined a situation which became more and more intimidating with an outcome that could mean life or death. I swallowed hard and decided that I would- This is ridiculous. It's like, we just imagined this and, ah, uh, we didn't even become brave. Unlucky. Who are you? Oh, it's the host. Alright, I, I gotcha. I, I get it. I, I get it. What's he trying to take? Is he just trying to take this? Are you kidding? Seriously? That's your goal? A bit meager, isn't it? <laughs> no, please go like this so that we don't... No, what? So we don't have any attrition. Thank you. And you just go down here. We're gonna beat him up first and then we're gonna move on to the Seljuks. I think that's the best. I don't even need you to go here anymore. Your wife and Prasara sent you a gift. Thank you for the puppy. Uh, let's name you Faithful. We are in a wonderful position. Look, I just, I love how expansionary we can be. It's, it's really cute. The way we're just smashing everybody else. I love it. When are you gonna be that? 2nd of July? Perfect. I need some good commanders and in we go. Sorry, I don't even know why he wanted to come for this land, but I'm not gonna give it to him. Are you crazy? Are you out of your mind? 71%. Ugh. Wish I could just white piece him out. He pay us anything. No. You just get less prestige. Sure, whatever, dude. You still get imprisoned. It's like a rebellion. Absolutely useless to take a white piece. If, you know, if you were part of the rebellion and your master actually went, you know what? Let's just uh, get all imprisoned. That's a good piece deal, right? You gotta, you gotta tell him you're out of your mind. Because this is insane. All these people just being like, yep, white peace. Uh, I will now live in your prison. Love them. Love idiocy from the AI. But I guess it is intended, but nope. Ah, I should not. Ah, well. Oh, it is peasant rebel uh, rolled for no reason whatsoever. Oh, there come the Seljuks, guys. There come the Seljuks. Oh, and you know what? Here come we. Actually, I think you can stay. I don't think we need you there. Hell yeah. Nope, I will not become a Satanist. Thank you very much. Wait, what? Oh no! <laughs> what did I do? Alright, you know what? Now we do need everyone. Your dog is growing quickly and is no longer a little puppy. Very nice. We've seen that event a million times by now. Yeah, take him down. Okay, who cares? Alright, that I just uh, misdirected my armies there, but that's okay. None of my business. Get out of here. We haven't had a single hunting event, have you noticed? Hmm. Gotta admit, I don't like it. Where are my hunting events at, yo? Now let's just keep sieging here. That should not be a problem anymore, seeing as we have defeated the main armies of the Seljuks. Oh, uh, sure. Not really gonna be skilled in it, but that's fine. I will make you ambitious. I hate all of my siblings, apparently. Um, you're 14, why don't you marry... The Emir of Verona? Oh, right. <laughs> right, that, that is correct. Apparently they're all Berber now. Very strange. It, it is a very strange life that everyone, included ourselves, of course, is living here. Well, what can you do, eh? What can you do? Hmm. This attrition hurts. We can't really do anything about it. But at the end of the day, you know it's fine. Cool. Don't really care about that law, but more power to you. Alright, let's just wait it out. Let's just, you know, keep sieging him. Can't even go against us anymore. They're way too weak now. Sucks to be you, Seldrix. Sucks to be you. Also, I need to get rid of this, these boats by now. Hey. Thank you. Why don't you just go, like, all the way over here? Is Odessa, if I'm not mistaken, is Armenia. Indeed it is. Meaning... Oh, you hold a bit of Anatolia. Meaning that if I take it, we will be in a much better sc uh, scenario. What did I mean to do? Oh, that's right. Because at that point, they won't uh, get any ticking war score anymore. <sighs> Life on easy mode. What is he doing? Hacking... Ooh, what? Anatolian Holy War for Paphlagonia. He's attacking Armenia. Ooh, good job, dude. Take it. Hell yeah, brother. He's literally my brother, by the way. I can actually say it like that. Very good. 
Very good indeed. And look at the Seljuks. They we used to fear them so much. It took me like 30 years until we were able to beat them back and actually take uh, Yemen. But here we are. Everything going exactly as planned. Absolutely beautiful. I don't want to that shift click. I don't really care. No. Thanks for asking, though. Oh, why not? Do we have any... Are you doing anything? No, I think he's having a good time. You know, he is our rival, but we don't hate each other. I wish that you could mend being rivals. But no such luck, it appears. I wish we could do it, most certainly. Burn the apostate, eh? Hell yeah. That's fine. Don't you worry about it. If he starts to hate me eventually, I will just imprison him. <laughs> Don't worry about it, okay? Forget about it. They're gonna get him out of here anyway. They have no chance. If anybody rebels against us, we will just destroy them. That's just the way it goes. Adopt the Marshall's ideas. Absolutely. Absolutely. Done. I think you... This is almost done, which should push us to 100%. I would like to offer my services right. Ooh, yeah. You know what? I will owe you one. Sure. Whatever you say. 100%. There you go. Bulls of Rishaba. Wait a minute. Why... Why are they... What is the trigger for this? Oh, is it the Gaznavids? It has to be, right? What is the... The giant holy site. Wait a minute. Yeah, okay. So these are the Hindu holy sites. I think that must... I think them crossing like this deep in. They don't hold Delhi, but... Pretty close to it. I don't actually know what triggers the, the holy orders in India. I have no idea. But you know what I do know? Game over. Oh! <laughs> this looks disgusting, but... Oh, uh, I'll take it. Sure, I'll take it, buddy. Hussein Ibn Suleiman. Welcome, and he is strong. Ariam is not strong. That is unlucky for her. Hope she survives. Hussein, welcome to the world, of course. Of course. Strong. I'll, I'll take it. That's a good start. You know, it's not a genius, but is what it is. Of course, that wasn't even with a genius lady, that was with a strong lady. Damn, she gave us a child despite being a homosexual. That is. Thank you for the effort, really. Would you like to convert, my friend? You can remain as the lord of these lands, but I need you to convert. Go on a, on a hunch here. 114 bucks, Jesus Christ. I'll let you rot, actually, you know what? Get him bombed, son. Hell yeah, I'm gonna bring you with me, Hussein. Hussam. Ibn Zubir. Thank you for becoming Shia. I really do appreciate it. Armenia, I can't usurp your title because you still hold stuff in. Oh, you hold one province in Armenia. If I were to take that from them, I could usurp Armenia. Like, all of it. That's pretty good. And also, yeah, look at these borders. It's not very nice, but once we own this, it will be beautiful. I would like, at the end of the series, I would love if we could own Constantinople. Somebody has to do it, right? Somebody has to own it. What are we, 48 out of 100 years? I think we can do it. I definitely think we can get this done. Now, with that being said, hello there. I know it's kind of worthless, but I do want to hold... No, not this. Um, I would like to take... What the hell is it? I'll do a conquest for... What is this? Colonia. There you go. Thank you, yes. Only has 10k troops anyway, and they are already in my territory. Well, 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 if this isn't perfect. Well, they have a lot of troops here, actually. Slightly weaker. She got healed, though. That's nice. Good to see you. Gonna listen to the old man. I, I always like listening to the Hadiths, actually. The old man says, as the Holy Quran says, You desire the attractions of the world, but Allah desires the next world for you. And yes, you prefer the life of this world, but the next world is better and more lasting. I've actually already heard that one. Okay, that's fine. I'm humbled. Allah, there is no difference between a caliph and a pauper. Interesting. You know what? If he's humbled, then let's become humble. Sure. The ninth day in Mecca, you perform the Wukuf at, uh, at Mount Arafat with the entire afternoon dedicated to comp contemplate a vigil, pr uh, praying and reciting the Holy Quran. Good for you. 
Ah, it's a level 6 fort, of course. And we've returned. If only we could be, uh... If only we could be going on a hunt, but the game has not felt like it at all so far. Look at that, I, I got some of these types that I really don't want. Which one? Mario. I think we can hold the rest, we can hold on to that. You are already betrothed, that's fine, don't need to worry about you ever anymore. Are they coming for me? I hope so. They're coming for these ones, that would also be nice. But I do need them to make a decision here so that I can take them out. Yeah, foolish, very foolish. Locked in on the 20th. On the 19th we can start walking. They have the very best commanders right here and uh, the white lion, let's go, do it. Let's go. Cool. Closer than I would have liked, but still quite decisive, I would argue. I hope the solution would solve itself after the baby came out, but... Uh, I hope the solution would solve itself? What? And my wife's temper still remains a problem. I could try and tell her to calm, li uh, calm a little, I suppose. I'm sure. I don't think she said yes. <laughs> oh, I got wounded, excuse me! That's domestic violence! What the hell? I did not even manage to make my case. My wife just snapped at me and pushed me over the stairs. I think I broke something. Holy crap. Empress Sarah. If you hadn't given me that child, I, I don't know what I would do. God damn. Yeah, this will be one, I think, once we take this. And then we can actually usurp Armenia. Oh, that guy is sting, buddy. And he only has one kingdom, too. I learned a Jewish man has appeared at your court. Nice. Demon of Dingy. Very nice. Battle my horse for sure. Hope I'm not gonna assault that. No chance am I gonna assault any of these. Holy crap. Those are some terrible odds. Assaulting. Is this everything that he holds in Armenia? No, oh no it is. It totally is. Yo, that makes it so easy. I will actually be able to uh, take it all. And again, he probably will be at war. Yeah, he's in so many wars. I can't immediately usurp it, but that's fine. Emirate of Samos, keep it up. An epic hunt it shall be, please. Give me... Fruitlessly scouring the countryside, you come upon a small cottage in the wilds. As you knock, an old crone opens. When she sees you and your hunting party, she cackles eerily and says that she has a powerful potion that will make you a stronger hunter, sure to catch any prey. Please, usually this ends poorly. Oh, you drink the potion down. Soon you start to feel all warm inside. The crone whispers, see, you know that this will make you stronger. I can see it in your eyes. Now go, great hunter. You return home, certainly to believe that next time you will find your prey. Let's go, please. You always seem to be thinking several steps ahead of the people near you. There are a few people alive who can match your mental prowess, and when your intellect is focused on a single problem, people know a solution will be found. Allah, glorified and exalted be he, does not play dice. True. They return to your court. The hunt for this elusive white uh, beast seems fruitless, but there are many more things out there in the wilds. Maybe next time we'll catch your prey. Let's go! The next time will be it. I can feel it in my bones. I could become arbitrary. <laughs> sure. Emulating a legend by becoming arbitrary. Hell yeah, brother. God, why are all of the... Every single member of this dynasty that, you know, has a good kind of personality, I suppose, is a bastard. Every single one of them is a, is a son of a gun. No, don't make me sick. Not like this. Heal me. Heal me. Thank you. We appreciate it. Wait a minute, what is your weak claim on? Yeah, we're not gonna... Sorry to tell you, we're not gonna go for that. I could, theoretically, but I don't think that's right. I don't think we should bother. And we're no longer sick, they've done it. Absolute legends. Uh, we've also won the war. There you go. What is this? Oh yeah, hold the tournament, absolutely. There we go. Let's do all the tournament. There you go. What should we do after this is over? I were to kill him, no, I, I definitely can't kill him, but if I were to kill him, I think this would split. I mean, I'm not entirely certain, but I believe that this would split. At least I hope so. It would be amazing. We are facing yet another rebellion. Man, he's still so damn strong, despite holding barely anything of his former 
you know, wannabe empire. We're the only empire around, really, but, you know, you know what I mean. I'm sat next to Princess Vosgi at a dinner when she tells about... Nope, I will... Should we become Zoroastrian? <laughs> that would be the perfect meme, huh? You know what? Such sen uh, senseless violence. My heart aches for them. Yeah, absolutely. The first year begins and the coming two months shall separate those gifted with the skills of a warrior from those who would only pretend at such. <laughs> Let's become Zoroastrian, eh? Let's become Zoroastrian indeed. Oh, that's a ridiculous sentiment, but I love it. You know what? I think that would be a good idea. Uh, what would also be a good idea is actually, I think we should go to war against the uh, Mignoseeds at this point. Invasion of Ifrikia. We don't even have the damn piety. God damn it. Do we have any claim for a kingdom? I could go for a great uh, conquest of... Nope. Surprise even more. I would love to go for Ifrikia, no doubt. Having Africa under control would, uh, I think, add quite a lot. But you know what? Let's just get rid of all of these troops here. Don't want to pay for them. Burn him. Get him out of here. I don't think I can even get a secret religion because I am the Caliph. But wouldn't becoming Zoroastrian be an amazing nonsense twist? Young Saladin uh, loves doing those things his own way. Right. Uh, diligence? Yeah, let's go. Let's go, brother. Who are you going to marry? Hmm... Really good army leaders here for some reason. So many of them too. Oh. Well fought. Third champion, second champion, and the first champion, Hussein. Hussein is indeed a mighty warrior. And the event is over. Beautiful. As he's growing older, I can see that Saladin uh, could use some guidance. I... you know what? Let's just make everyone ambitious in this family, except myself that is, I suppose. But let's do it. Man, we are so close to having amazing borders. I, I already love it, but you know what? We need to we need to go full Ottomans here. <laughs> the hunting dog needs proper training. I will train him personally, absolutely. Absolutely, no doubt about it. That is a good choice because we are amazing, of course, at uh, martial stuff. You're no longer wounded. Please let me go on a hunt. Let me capture it. I require for this to happen. Ray Eminence, look at you. In prison. How did you do it? Alright, good job. I guess. A bastard. Hmm. Come on now, Ashavna. Couldn't have done that. Oh no, another ambitious adventurer. What is he coming for, I wonder? Doesn't actually have a claim on anything here. I think he's probably just gonna go for the Holy Land. When is the next crusade? Speaking of Holy Land. 1177, five more years. Look, if they come for me again, I can easily beat them back. I've done it before, I can do it again. I can definitely do it again. Let them all rot. Come on, just give me a great hunt event. I just, I need the achievement. Game, I require you to serve my will. Also, can I marry some more people? I forgot about that. I actually wanted to marry more people that were, you know, at the very least, like a genius. Or, uh, what about some more strong people? 21? Cool. Take it. Nice. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about. Seljuks will win their rebellion. Uh, that is a pretty long piece there. That of Kalike could be usurped. Who cares? I don't really need to assassinate this man. God damn, we are insanely strong. And I absolutely love it, just for the record here. I got nothing against this. This is it's fun to blob in a way that, you know, at least resembles. The historical borders. Look at that. It has worked. We are also more healthy for it because we have educated this dog on the lessons of, you know, how to be a good dog. You're still the same ruler, so I can't do anything against you. That sucks. Assad of Yazdian Peasant Revolt has declared Peasant Revolt for Yazd. Void. Uh, where the hell are you? Over there. Unlucky for you. Incredibly unlucky. You know what I'm thinking? Let me just dissolve you. Just for a moment here. Oh, let's go. We're gonna land in Greece. We're gonna go full Ottomans. We're not gonna take Constantinople until it's already fairly late. Oh, I'm ready for this. Athens will fall. Give me boats, please. Quite enough, but this should be, I wanna say. Yes, thank you. Oh, I'm ready. 
Also, I probably can ignore this. Persia should be able to take care of this. Would confuse me if that wasn't true. Now, let's go up to Athens and uh, teach him a bit of a lesson here. Anybody joining in on the war? No. Damn. Sucks to be Athens. Uh, oh. I thought somebody... An enemy was there already invading it, but nope. That's just them. Fine. Gather some morale and then let's move in. We do have the Camel Cavalry on our side, but we're not even catching them. Uh, unlucky. Alright. This is a really good entry point. I can take Constant uh, Constantinople last. Much like it happened historically. I'm a huge fan of this idea. So cheesy. Well, there you go. The Persians are going in and... Easy victory for them, of course. But we're not going on a hunt, are we? Hmm... Yes, bring me the artifact, please. We do have... Why am I not using this one? Yeah, why, why am I not using this? I would like an armor, I think. We are making mad money and everything, so we might as well, right? That's for a smith here. I would like an armor. My wife is pregnant, very nice. Very, very nice indeed. No longer stress, thank you, my dog. Yeah. Sultan Arif of Persia, an alliance with the Abbasids. I mean, that's good for me because it means that they can't blob into each other. Meaning that uh, not much will be going on in their world. Blah, 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 blah. Nothing here yet is... All I'm waiting for is, is uh, Armenia. Uh, all I'm waiting for is to be able to usurp Armenia. That's literally it. Yes, invite this armorsmith, thank you. I'm in need of protection, my friend. Rafika the armorsmith. Hell yeah. I will pay everything. I will literally go into debt for this. Look at you. Doing pretty well. Betroth to him, sure. Everybody hates me. Let's be let's be entirely realistic here. Every one of my family hates me because I made all of them ambitious. I'll take it. Definitely, I'll take it. And I'll lose the 50 prestige. Who cares? I most certainly don't. Go to Yopolis. Come on, man. Why is the game not letting me go on a hunt? Please. I'm gonna teach you about kindness. I, I killed, I embalmed so many people, and yet I didn't become cruel. I wanna teach you uh, about being a good parent, yeah? Why are, the, why are you in this? Did they actually join the war here? Yeah, they did. I will name the armor champion. Oh, it's just quality three. Oh, that's okay. We have a siege master, yes. Status quo is over. China has recently been suffering from droughts and the people are starving as a great famine upsets the harmony in the divine land. Sucks to be you, China. Sucks to be you. Right, we're gonna get this done as soon as possible. I don't even think the Byzantines are actually coming over. They're like just walking around up there quite confused. Oh no, you siege my land. Once we take all of this, it's literally over, buddy. Don't even worry about it. Don't even worry about it. There's no way they can siege down enough to actually, you know, make it impossible to win. If they only have one province, it's over after that one province has fallen. It's just uh, done with. Let's do this and then let's call it a day here for this episode. What artifact did he find? Sheikh Jabir has returned and brought with him a beautiful sword. He has proved that it is one of the Pro uh, Prophet Muhammad's nine swords. Not only is it a finely crafted blade, but it should also make men more eager to follow me into battle. Let's go! Yo, I'm gonna pay ya. Absolutely. Are you crazy? That's insane. That is actually insane. Um, let's take a look at this. Sword of Muhammad, quality four. Thank you. Screw the Pope's uh, spear. Who cares? We've done it. What are the actual effects on it, by the way? I did not actually read it. Ooh, combat skill, uh, skill goes up quite a bit. New realm, Ruthenia. He already was a king of Ruthenia, just for the record. So he has, you know, effectively just stole some valor. But at this, ooh, everybody's around here trying to interrupt me, but I don't think that they will succeed. Oh, well, that makes it easier. I would like to revoke your title. Nice try, buddy. Nice freaking try. And with that being done, if I'm not mistaken here, yeah, look at that. Invasion of Greece. 
We're gonna take everything but Thrace. Everything but Constantinople, and then we're gonna take him down. I love it. I really love the way that goes. But, you know, they are quite, like, big, but I don't feel like they actually are a threat. I think we could beat him if we really wanted to. I just don't think we really need to care for the moment. Yeah, at, lo at, at least not right now. I want to thank you for tuning in yet again, 45 minutes, Jesus Christ, uh, to an episode where we were, you know, blobbing a bit. We are now at 52 out of 100 years. It is progressing quite nicely. And I want to thank the members of the channel, namely the Barons, Aaron, Stefan, the Richest, T, Snywolf, Emma, Mello, and Thomas. Who's also the Counts, K, Malik, 2, Shifty, and X on the Naughty. And last but not least, the Dukes, the Special Stark, Benedict, Nathan, Knight of Squires, Kenneth, Lexo, Roboman, my dad left me at Arby's, and the Absolute Legends, Eric and Aiden. Thank you so much for supporting the channel directly. If you also want to support the channel, then check out the join button right underneath the member, uh, right underneath the video, where you can see membership tiers and perks. I will see you in the next episode. Until then, later. Alligator.